At the same time, uh, the p most members of parliament have expressed solidarity with Saudi Arabia and its concerns uh, about the situation on its uh, neighborhood. And uh, uh, there is strong commitment to protect and uh, defend, if necessary, a ceasefire. But obviously, they say ceasefire will consolidate the existing ground position. So the Jordanian resolution, which represents the Arab viewpoint, is on embargo on arms supplies, as well as condemnation of the takeover of the removal of a legitimate government by force. So I don't think these uh, solutions will have any relevance to the problem. The problem is the need for the, for the Yemenis to be helped in order to talk to each other to finish this fighting and also to be mindful of the fact that Al-Qaeda and Daesh are waiting. Not actually waiting fighting, have a ceasefire, stop aerial bombardment, stop operations on the ground. Unfortunately, we're faced with the challenge of extremism, terrorism, and violence. And we need to use our every effort, every opportunity, in order to put an end to bloodshed, particularly bloodshed among Muslims. It, is, it pains us all to see conflict and bloodshed in various parts of the Islamic world, and it pains us all to see extremist groups painting a very negative picture of Islam across the world, which has nothing to do with Islam and its divine message uh, and its sublime teachings. We need to work together in order to put an end to the crisis in, in Yemen. Uh, people of Yemen should not suffer from aerial bombardment.